<gasps> nope. Okay, Steven. My magnet is stuck, guys. My magnet is stuck. We tried pulling it. Steven volunteered to go in. I got it stuck. And it felt like it was coming in with something on it heavy. Oh, it is! What's up, everyone? Outdoor more. Uh, today, we are going back to the place where we found the keys. Um, hopefully, we're looking forward to having good stuff this time. And uh, we're going to see what's going to happen. This is the same place where the sheriff told us there was a car under, so we're going to try not to hit no cars under the water. So, yeah. This has got to be the perfect place. You got vehicles moving up top. Oh, man, you know things fall off into the water. Nothing amazing. Just little chunks of metal. Okay guys, we got a lure, a little fishing lure, and a piece of metal. <laughs> and we had a fish out the other magnet, my brother threw it in. <laughs> okay guys, uh, I'm pulling up this a big old chunk of metal. There's like a curtain or something. Pulled it out right there. I think I'm gonna hit this area up again, see what I can find. Okay guys, here's an update. I found a whole bunch of bottle caps, lures, nothing major. Uh, some nails, that pipe. Steven just found. Just some nails and a weight. A weight, nails. So, nothing major yet, but we got this. All right, I think my brother just found something. Hey, man, Bring it in, girl. Huh? I feel lucky with this one, Steven. Yeah, but I think it broke. Broken vice grips. A nail. Man. What is that? More bottle caps. Been getting that all the time. Yep, I'm gonna try one more out here. Okay, guys. This isn't looking good for me. Looks like I might have to go down and probably get my magnet out. <sighs> Crap. I don't have nothing either to tell me to let them know that I'm here because there's a guy right here. <sighs> I don't have my flippers either, right? Oh man, I think it's stuck on a rock. You gotta go in and get it? I guess. <laughs> you need a flashlight because it's gonna be dark down there to see. I'm not gonna dive down, I'm gonna hold on to the rope and kind of swim out that okay. way. Maybe you can pull it out that way. <gasps> nope. I'm gonna break my arm. <sighs> Dang. Oh, you got my shoes on? Okay. Good job, good job. <sighs> you got this, Steven. You got this. Oh the God. hero. Oh <laughs> yeah, the man with the plan. You got everything's out of your pocket? Yeah, everything's out of my pocket. Okay, that's good, that's good. Okay, Steven. Uh, my magnet is stuck, guys. My magnet is stuck. We tried pulling it. Steven volunteered to go in. I got it stuck. Remember, guys. Uh, he's the, <laughs> we just, dude, it was like 40 degrees this morning. 
He volunteered. I didn't make him. He volunteered. Yeah, I mean, that's not what I'm going to get out, though. No. Nah. short time anyway, so. Yeah, that's true. Okay. Here. Ugh. Now, if you can, you'll have to swim out at a distance, right? Is that how you're going to get out? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to swim out. I'm not going to dive in the water. Because I got to know. A slight ear infection when we went scuba diving. Oh, that's right. I didn't have earplugs on. Just don't get your head underwater then. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try not to get one. Uh, I'm gonna do. Try to swim out that way. And kind of pull it out that way. Okay. And when I do, you bring me back in. Deal. Be careful, dude. You just got an ear infection from the last river. Steven. Huh? No. Uh, if I have my other camera, I can. I go into water and I get a. Uh, I pull stuff up. No. You ain't touching the bottom, are you? Not here. He's not touching the bottom. Baby, need your help. I need you to bring me. Uh, my earplugs by the microwave. The magnet got stuck. I was pulling, I was pulling something, and it got stuck. So I gotta go see what what is stuck on and where it's stuck at. So I'm gonna have to get in the water. Uh, huh? Okay. Uh, no, just even went in there to free it, but it's jammed in there, so. I told Steven not to stick his head on the water because he had that ear infection. Are you down the front of the boat? Okay. Hold on, there's a guy who will help us. Alright. I was able to ask this guy for some help, so he's gonna put Greg on the front of the boat <laughs> and help him try to get it unstuck. Tell you what, that water is cold, as you can tell. My nipples can cut glass right now. You probably have to go back out that way, because it felt like it went like this. Yeah, because it felt like it went like this. So what happened was Greg threw it out. It felt like it got stuck, but we were able to still pull on it. And it felt like it was coming in with something on it heavy. And then all of a sudden it just got stuck, like it just wedged. It, it was just too much. So I was able to pack this man down. This nice fella. And see if he's able to help us unwedge it. Tied at the end of the boat. 
put it out that way. Did you get it, Greg? Oh, sorry. The camera's like not focusing or on them. My bad. I'm kind of. Is it? Oh, it is. What'd you get on it? Look like a. Oh, okay. Once you come in the water, get one up. Better yet, toss that rope over here. <laughs> get the rope, not not the thing, just the rope, and I'll. Get off your hand, Greg. Dude, what was it? Uh, it looks like a, a rail. Hold on one second. That magnet was not gonna let that go. And I can tell you what. See how this, look at this right here, man. That's a good bout. Oh my God. Huh? That's, a, that, that's what it was, it was stuck. It wasn't, this magnet wasn't gonna let it go. 2,600 uh, pull on it. You got that thing, huh? Yeah. Thank you, Brute Magnet. Guys, his name is Stefan. This gentleman helped me out so much. Uh, he pulled it up. Uh, I'm going to talk to him right now. This baby's heavy. We're going to take it with us so it's not laying around damaging anything. We're going to take this bad boy with us. Man, this baby worked, Brute, Brute Magnetics. You're awesome. I just don't know how I'm gonna get it off. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Ready, step on this side. Oh God. Right. Steven, I was gonna throw another one out there, but I don't know. <laughs> Pull it off, Steven. Pull it off. <laughs> Pull it off, Steven. God, thanks to that guy in that boat, he helped us out a million. Oh my God. All right, so we're gonna break down what happened. Uh, you wanna go ahead, Greg, tell your story? Okay, so. I was throwing the double-sided uh, 2,600 pound magnet in and it got stuck. I felt the pull, but then it got stuck. So I thought it was stuck under the rocks or something. And then that's when we got Steven to go in. And when I went in there, I, I felt it. When I went to go pull it, I felt it like wanting to come up, but it was just too heavy for me to bring up, especially in the water. It was actually pulling me back downwards. So I was able to flag this guy who was coming over. Uh, if it wasn't for him, he wouldn't. Have, you know, we wouldn't probably gotten out. But uh, thank God he had a boat and everything, and he was oh able to help God. us to get us out, get it out. Greg got on the boat. They tied it off, and we're able to drag it back. But I'm gonna tell you something though. That magnet did not want to <laughs> let go. <laughs> <laughs> Pull it off, Stevie. God. <laughs> oh that. Dude, bad metal that was scary i'm not gonna lie i thought i thought that was it i thought my magnet was a goner i was like no dude i just got this from brute i just got this from brute man i was all terrified